compared to our old E-Series, which had a hydraulic drive generator, we actually used less than half the amount of fuel to heat up the screen. When I talk about direct drive generator, it's a component in between the engine, so right on the back of the bell housing, and the uh, four-hole pump drive. Okay, so it's running directly off the engine, uses an inverter to uh, start it up, basically. It's a, a switch reluctance generator. So put a little bit of power in, you get a lot of power out. And uh, that's used to regulate the voltage with varying engine RPM. I mentioned heating up at in 15 minutes. At, that's done at 1300 RPM with the standard width screen. As you add extensions, okay, the heating system uh, sees those extensions added and it will adjust engine RPM to optimize the heat up time. So um, if we put one, ex one set of extensions on it'll just bump it up a little bit. If we go out to the full extension package width of 33 feet for this screen, it'll run up to 2200 RPM and uh, with that full package it'll still heat up in 25 minutes. We have a quiet heat up mode also where it keeps the engine RPM at 1300 RPM for the whole heat up and even with that full extension package it'll heat up in 35 minutes to 130C. So very fast heat up times and uh, very efficient. It makes it easier to plan the job. You don't have to start heating up until the truck's on its way, right? Or if you're moving, doing more commercial work and moving from spot to spot a lot of times the trucks are right there with asphalt already, so you're just waiting on the screed to heat up.